hello friends welcome back to code tonight so in today's video we will be working with paypal card testing okay so uh, sometimes when you will try to enter some test card details and try to uh, make a dummy payment here you will notice that you will be having this error we weren't able to add this card check all the details are correct and uh, try again or try uh, a different card okay so uh, this uh, becomes a problem when you try to uh, test with the sandbox account like you want to do dummy payments then we get this error or you can also get that card couldn't be added error so these two are card related error so for this error what you have to do is uh, you have to generate some new credentials from uh, paypal so here if you log into your paypal account you will see tools over here in the tools you will see a credit card generator okay so on this option you will be opened with this page here you can see credit card generator for testing here you have to select the card type and you have to select the region over here okay so once you have selected the region you can generate credit card okay now this card details are generated okay now we will try to put the details uh, in the screen okay so here I will just change the location to USA and then we will fill the details that we got from there. So this is the card I have added. Okay. Now we have got 11 20, So I will put here 11 23. Now we need CVV, so we will get 537 over here, so we will add this. Okay, so now uh, coming to the uh, billing address point. Okay, so since we are using a United States uh, reason here, so what is important is uh, that you have to enter uh, details related to the United States only, because if you will try to enter uh, like uh, India details, then it will not work. Okay. So either you can generate Indian credentials and then you can try or you can just look for random USA address. Okay. So the first link over here, you can click on that. And this is a site which will provide you some random addresses, but these are valid ones. Okay. So you can fill the details here one by one. For example, I have added these details from uh, from the same link. Okay, so these are like from United States. Okay, you can put anything in the uh, apartment uh, because this is optional. But apart from that, you will be able to copy from uh, uh, this link. Okay, so everything is provided here like the street address and uh, zip code. Okay, so you can copy from there. Now, once we have done adding the um, dummy USA address and the card number that we copied, so now we, you have to put mobile number and email that you can put anything. Now, I will just turn this thing off. Okay. Now, we will just uh, click on continue as guest. So before that, what I am trying to do is uh, I am trying to put a breakpoint in the code. Okay. So once you click on continue as cached, now it must be creating a success payment and it should return back to your uh, code with the payment token okay so this is the screen and that we have the code part okay so here i have added some breakpoints that will let you see okay the process now i just want to make you i just want to show you that card is working so here this code we will also add one video about this code so you can get the code in that case from that video okay so it is giving a error which we can see okay so the error is saying duplicate invoice id detected 
so this is a different error that we will solve in uh, another video but if you are having a correct invoice number then your payment card will work for you okay so uh, then uh, you can just uh, use these uh, cash card details for your testing so basically cash card has worked before if if it is wrong then you will see the same error message that we seen in the beginning of, of the video but since we are not getting that message so uh, these card details have actually worked so you have to remember that when you use this card detail then you also have to choose the correct address while adding the details from and this website you can copy the addresses so thanks for watching guys and let us know if you face any kind of issue and about the errors that you have just seen. We also will make a video for those. So thanks for watching.